Today we're going to look at some rocks that glow in the dark. Everybody likes stuff that glows in the dark. So whether you're 5 years old or 500 years old, you're going to like this. Unless, of course, I explain everything with some complicated scientific terminology that will take all the fun out of it. Isn't this amazing? These are fluorescent minerals. But what is a fluorescent mineral? Well, when certain minerals are exposed to ultraviolet light, they give off radiation that appears as visible light to us in the dark. The word ultraviolet pertains to a band of electromagnetic radiation having wavelengths from about 5 to 400 nanometers that are shorter than violet light. Violet light, of course, has the shortest wavelengths on the visible spectrum to human eyes. Oh, I'm sorry, am I getting too scientific? Okay, okay, okay. Uh, ultraviolet is basically just a fancy word that refers to light that we can't see. But just because we can't see it doesn't mean it doesn't exist. These rocks show that ultraviolet light is present. What causes these minerals to put off light? The ultraviolet light shining on them disrupts the orbits of the electrons in their atoms. It's like the electrons know they're being knocked out of place and they try to work their way back. This movement releases energy that we see as light. In fact, even when the ultraviolet light is shut off, some of the rocks continue to give off light for a time. This is still the effect of the electrons moving back to their original orbits. We call this effect phosphorescence. What you are looking at here is at the Franklin Mineral Museum in the town of Franklin in northwestern New Jersey. This is an excellent place to check out fluorescent minerals as well as many other types of rocks and minerals. You can go through their mine display to see what it takes to get these minerals out of the earth. Then you can even go outside to their rock pile and collect some for yourself. There's also a dark room with ultraviolet lights that you can use to check out your finds to see which ones you may want to keep. Then, if you want to invest in a filtered shortwave ultraviolet lamp, you can see your rocks glow at home. Just be sure not to look directly into the light bulb as that can cause damage to your eyes. Exposure can also burn your skin. So that's your science lesson for today.